Al Hijaz, ridden by Willie Carson. Two, Swing Low, Richard Quinn. Three, Al Flora, Mick Canan. Four, Calling Collect, Cash Asmussen. Five, Hazam, Walter Swinburne. Six, Inner City, Michael Roberts. Seven, Powerful Edge, Frankie de Torre. Eight, Feminine Wiles, John Reed. Nine, Catrail, Ray Cochran. And you'll note that uh, Factual is a non-runner. And here's how they bet at the moment. And Royal Ascot opens with a very strong favourite in Inner City, which is six to four in the first show. Catrail, four to one second uh, favourite. Al Hijaz, nine to two. Swing Low and Hazam are on tens. Then there's a gap to uh, Al Flora, Calling Collect, Feminine Wiles, all on 20 to one, and Powerful Edge, 33 to one. Yes, in a city into stall two. That's Powerful Edge nearest to us, and they're away. Powerful Edge breaks well towards the near side. Hazam coming over from the far side. And electing to come up the centre of the course, these nine runners, with Al Hijaz, one of those prominent in the early stages. Four representatives, Al Flora actually the leader, Al Flora the leader, four representatives of uh, Sheikh Mohammed. Cut rail is close up on the near side in those blue bandages with Al Hijaz a close third on the far side. But Al Flora taking him along from Al Hijaz and Cut rail. Then comes Powerful Edge, just on being tracked by Powerful Edge in a city. But it's still Al Flora the leader. Al Flora from Cat Rail in the distinguishing uh, sash there under Ray Cochran on the far side Al Hijaz. The black cap there in the, in the Mohammed colors calling collect on the far side. Inner city on the near side and between horses powerful edge. But still Al Flora the leader. Al Flora from Cat Rail in second, Al Hijaz third over on the far side. Inner City getting closer all the time towards the right of the picture with just in behind them Swing Low making his effort now. Inside the final two furlongs, Al Flora being pressed by Cat Rail and Inner City, the favorite coming there strongly to take it up now under Michael Roberts. And Inner City is the leader as they race into the final 150 yards. It's Inner City from Al Flora, Hazam putting in a good run over on the far side, but in a city from Al Flora. Al Flora fighting back as they come to the line. It's going to be close. Al Flora's got up to with it at the line. Al Flora the winner from in a city in second with Hazam third and swing low four. And so that powerful surge of uh, Al Flora Ridden by Mick Kinane, looks as though he's come there to save the bookmakers. Officially, it's a photo finish at the end of the opening race at the Royal Ascot Festival, the Queen Anne Stakes. But I think we'll find that the winner is number three, Al Flora, owned by Circle Chart Limited, trained by Clive Britton and ridden by Mick Kinan, that uh, Irish jockey, Irish champion who has such a remarkable record for spare rides in this country and of course who won the derby on commander-in-chief and he's in a photograph with the uh, british champion inner city south african born british champion michael roberts on inner city owned by sheikh mohammed trained by luca kumani with another of the sheikh mohammed runners number five hazam trained by michael stout and written by walter swinburne I think we'll find third. But it's a photo finish officially, but I think once again, Mick Kinnan has got up in the closing stages. Number three, Al Flora, 20 to one. Second, number six, Inner City, six to four favorite. And third, number five, Hazam, 11 to one.